girls and guys, it's Presley, and today I'm going to be telling you guys a short story just before I get into this actual topic that I'm going to talk about. So it all started on Tuesday night when I was laying in bed, you know, just watching YouTube videos, doing normal stuff before I go to bed, and then BAM! I get a text message from my older brother saying, if you ever need a bud to talk to, you'll always have me. And that was the most sweetest text message I've ever gotten from my older brother. And that text message gave me an idea on what to make for this video. And it's basically talking about there's always someone to talk to. Like, if you know anyone, like a sibling, um, a friend, a parent... Or anyone else you know like they'll always be there when you really need them to talk to like any emotional baggage going on in your life or anything else happening recently like news or any other like gossip everybody loves gossip right but for me well conversations can be a bit difficult for me because I repeat myself a lot and I don't have a whole lot of friends well technically when it comes to me going to school they're mostly my acquaintances so basically I don't have any main friends to talk to or make them come over at my house cuz I don't invite anyone at my house cuz you know uh, I don't have a whole lot of friends, like I just said, so. And the other thing is, I get lonely a lot. Even though I surround myself with a lot of good people in my life, I still feel lonely inside. But, I still surround myself with good people just so I can talk to them, you know, express myself throughout my honesty and opinions. I got a lot of opinions throughout everything I have to say because opinions are really important. Some people can get really offended just because you just expressed your opinion. And there are a lot of people like that who just just talks about their opinion and then they get offended, which is kind of odd, you know, in my, uh, but the best part is when it comes to conversations is that you keep an open mind. Lots of people keep an open mind, especially me. I like to, you know, talking for me, well, I like to talk. It ain't, it ain't that hard, really, but it can be hard to talk to someone because I don't know a whole lot of people when I'm in school because I'm an introvert and I stick with a specific group of people and I talk to them most of the time, so. But if I continue to talk to the same people that I know and maybe I won't feel so lonely and maybe you won't feel so lonely either because keep it an open mind, expressing your opinions throughout your honesty and whatnot will make you feel a whole lot better. It's kind of like an antidepressant, you know, like a therapy, you know. Talk about your problems and try to make sure what's make, what makes you comfortable, what's wrong, what's happened recently that made you feel a certain way. And you will feel a lot better once you talk about certain things that are messing you up or any other things well basically so that's all i have to say in this week's video and if you have anyone to talk to that you know of you can just go ahead and talk to that person don't talk to strangers though because if you don't know if you see someone that you don't know of and you really want to talk to somebody don't talk to strangers that's what you should learn from your parents don't talk to strangers and I'm sure everyone knows not to talk to strangers. So, anyway, like, comment, share, subscribe, all that jazz. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace!